not as nasty and brutish and short as it used to be. Because we've taken a lot of things that were part of the human condition and we've pathologized them. And we've pathologized them as soon as we had a treatment. So what would have been an enhancement becomes a, becomes a treatment for a disease. When, um, when vaccination came along, it was truly an enhancement. To be able to resist to childhood diseases, for instance, is just an amazing enhancement and the kind of thing that people resisted as unnatural at the time. Um, and, uh, and now it's just like a, a, a requirement. You know, it, it's, it's to get yourself up to our new baseline, you have to vaccinate. Admittedly, I, mean, I know there's some controversies around that, but that's not really germane. Um, and one of my, I, I, I can't stop doing this. One of my favorite uh, of these examples is when Benjamin Franklin invented the lightning rod, a bunch of people were mad at him for subverting the will of God. Now, I do challenge you to find a Christian, and eh, I guess it's probably possible, but to find a Christian who at this point wouldn't have a lightning rod because it was subverting the will of God. Our perception has definitely changed. So let's look at what we pathologize and what we don't. Because when we say we don't pathologize something, we're just saying that's part of being human. It's ridiculous to treat that like a disease. Um, now, actually, one of the things I, I, should, I should mention really quickly is that the difference, the technical difference between an enhancement and a treatment is not at all. There's nothing intrinsic to the idea of enhancing, bringing above baseline, or treating a disease that reflects in any way on the procedure. So there is no technical difference. There are only societal differences on this. Um, oh, um, so we talk about like what's non-pathological. Non-pathology does and always will have normal, uh, broad normal ranges. Physique, intelligence, antisocial energy levels. Um, I love, reduced libido in women is something we have to learn to live with. Um, their challenges, we're expected to, to gain life skills to live with them. And the reason I love that last one is because the last one here is erectile function in men. That's a disease. 